El Salvador, a nation struggling with adversity, has been thrust into the global spotlight due to its alarming rates of violence. In the year 2016, it reported a staggering 81.2 murders per 100,000 people. This statistic, while shocking, is sadly just the tip of the iceberg. The root causes of these grim figures go beyond the obvious culprits of gang activity. The root causes of the alarming violence in El Salvador go beyond the obvious culprits of gang activity. Corruption, political collusion with criminal organizations, and an epidemic of violence against women and environmental activists all play significant roles. The Department of Homeland Security in 2018 announced the termination of temporary protected status for Salvadoran migrants, leaving them with a stark choice. Leave the U.S., obtain a green card, or face deportation. Latin America as a region is grappling with a significant homicide problem, and El Salvador unfortunately stands out in this grim lineup. The situation in El Salvador serves as a stark reminder of the devastating effects of corruption, political collusion, and systemic violence. It's a sobering lesson for the international community, highlighting the urgent need for comprehensive strategies to combat such deep-seated issues. In conclusion, the safety situation in El Salvador is a convoluted issue, intricately woven with threads of corruption, political collusion, and unabated violence. It's not just about gangs but a pervasive culture of crime that permeates every level of society. This video has been a deep dive into the factors contributing to the safety situation in El Salvador, from the high rates of violence to the political corruption and collusion. It's a complex issue, and one that requires urgent attention from the international community.